Hi guys, Wendy here. In this video, we're going to draw my drastic cute baby Jesus. So let's get started. With this drawing, we're going to first start by drawing the body of baby Jesus wrapped up. So right here, I'm going to start and draw a curve. So it's going to be a long curve. And notice it's going to go slightly up right here. So this is kind of like where his um, chest and his arms would be. And then I'm going to bring it down. Up right here. And so notice I'm kind of ending at the same area on the other side, on this side. So notice it's just an upward towards curve and then it comes down. So from there to make it easier, before I draw the head, I'm going to come here and layer some of the hay. So I'm going to come here and break this line off with one curve and then another one and one more. So we're just going to hit this area right here and down. Okay, so I know it looks really weird right now, <laughs> but it's going to come together. So from there, let's draw the head. So I'm going to come about right here. So imagining his chest, his arms are right here. I'm going to come about, say, right here, and I'm going to draw a curve out. So this is going to be the beginning of his head. So it's just a curve up and back down. So when I come down, I'm not going to hit this area right here. I'm going to give myself some room and put another layer of hay about right here. So this way it looks like baby Jesus is tucked nicely into his little bed of hay. So that's the goal that we're trying to get right here. So from there, let's um, draw another layer so where his head, head is wrapped up. So I'm just going to come right here and basically I'm just going to follow the head shape and go all the way around and as I come here we can get a little bit fatter and bring it down. Okay so let's put eyes on this baby Jesus before um, <laughs> we can't figure out what's going on right? Okay so I'm gonna come in this area well let's draw the hair first then. So I'm gonna come up here and about right here I'm just gonna draw a curve tuck it in a little bit and come up right there just finish this part off and let's see here come over this side with a curve and I'm just going to tuck a little ear like that in the back in the bottom right here I mean so then let's come in this area so notice it's going to be at a slant and we're going to draw his eyes so it's going to be very simple eyes just a circle just to make it a lot easier and I'm going to directly go across over here and then right in the center right here we're going to draw a smile <laughs> and cap it off. Okay so I hope I made that easy for you to follow. It wasn't too tough right? Okay so then let's draw some details here maybe just draw some lines Make it look like it is a blanket wrapped up. And then now let's draw all the rest of the hay. So I'm going to come up about right here where his head is and I'm going to start to draw some curves and zigzags. So basically I'm going to start to draw this bed of hay. So I'm just zigzagging down and up and going to go all the way around. So before we do all the bottom right here. Let's imagine this going overlap by the head and we're going to come out about right here. So come out about right here and we're going to draw a curve. And another curve. So basically this is the back side and we're just going to aim for this oval shape right here. So we're going to keep going and about right here we're going to start to go down. So once again, the same thing, just up and down. And we're just trying to make it look like a soft bed of hay. So we're going to start to bring it down. And so just a bunch of zigzags up and down, some longer, some shorter. And we're just going to go all the way across and finish up this whole area.
like that. Okay, then let's come in here and let's add some little details right here to the end so it doesn't look like just little mounds. We can come in here and just soften this up a little bit here and give it some zigzags as well. And here and there you can add some zigzags. there okay so that's the goal right there and so then now let's draw the bed part right here the wooden part so I'm going to come right here and I'm going to draw an angle line so I'm coming down here and same thing on the other side so about let's see here about right here and I'm going to start to curve it in and go all the way across of a straight line <laughs> and then I'm just going to connect this so there now to draw the legs of the um, bed so let's come over here towards the edge right here and I'm going to start with an angle line and another one about right here about that thick following that line and just connect it then I'm going to imagine a piece of wood coming across this way right here to crisscross it and so about the same thickness and connect it and then right here you can draw a little circle to where it connects and same thing over here so let's come over here so let's just make sure we're about the same so I'm gonna give myself a line like that and about the same thickness this one looks a little bit long. Okay, so about right there. Okay, so then the other side, same thing. And connect it. So once again, you can put a little circle right here for some details. And that is pretty much it for this um, baby Jesus drawing. Um, but we couldn't finish it without drawing the Star of Bethlehem, right? Right on top. So right here in the center, let's see here, center, I'm going to go all the way up, let's say about right here. Just give myself a point and I'm going to start to draw the star. So I'm just going to start right here and draw two angle lines. So this is the top point. Then I'm going to come out with two points. So it's all nice and even and then from here I'm going to come out with a longer point come back in so let's do the same thing on the other side so let's just come across about right there and connect and then two more smaller ones right here and let's go straight down say about that long and finish it off so that way it's just a little bit more even. So we've got the Star of Bethlehem in and now let's draw some of the rays. So I'm just gonna come out here and lightly. Ooh, that was wobbly. <laughs> but you get the idea, right? So some shorter, some longer. Yikes, that was horrible. <laughs> okay, something like that. And then you can, um, if you want to spruce it up, just add some little stars here and there to make it look more magical. And let's see here, we add one here. And one more. So there, my Jurassic Cube baby Jesus in the manger. Thanks so much for watching, and if you loved it, please give me a thumbs up and share it, and remember to subscribe so you won't miss any new Jurassic Cube videos. See you later.